Jonathan. Is this mine? No, that's not. Mother Fudgeon, Martinez. That was yours. This is mine. yours. God damn. But stay there. I'm on my way because it's 12 a.m. and I see this yesterday. So why? Baby, I'm right here now. I got a show in LA where it's sold out. Hey yo, what's up guys? It's your boy the Mark Anthony here and welcome to a new video and today we're here in 6th Street a Couple of the videos gonna be in here and then we just got a bunch of different stuff. I'm not gonna take too long I hope y'all enjoy this video and Yeah, let's keep awesome weird guys All right, so today we're here with Alexa. So our first question is gonna be what's the biggest red flag in a guy? You can give me three if you want to <laughs> Where's ripped jeans? Oh. That is Damn! I felt like a little offended by that. Skinny rib cheeks. Hey yo, what the fuck? No, okay, these are skinny. So. <laughs> it's okay. It I'll, just I'll keeps getting worse and worse. <laughs> Probably like when they like say that they're gonna do something and then they don't. Mm. Like you know what I mean? So like, like say, oh, I'll call you in 20 minutes and then like they never call they you. Never call, ooh, okay. The next question is gonna be: If you're to be a guy for today, what's the first thing you would do? <laughs> you just want to find out how I want to see what it's like, like not in a weird way. <laughs> so I want to explore that shit and just yeah, let it go Yeah, I know, out. I want to pee. It's, it's different, not different it's, than sitting down. Yeah. So the last and final question is, so if you were to tell your ex one thing, and one thing only, you can be as honest as you want, what would you say to him? I seriously think that you lost the best thing ever twice, and I'm better for it. Oh. That's what I'm talking about! That's why he's doing it me! i so better for it. <laughs> You're gonna find your husband out here, right? I'm, dude, I'm in an amazing relationship right now. Period. Yes. So. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. All right, so today we're here with Corey. Corey, hey, all right. Carter. So the first question I'm gonna ask you, bro, is what is the biggest red flags in a female? You got three Big, if you want to. Okay, the biggest red flags in a female is if she got like guys like constantly blowing up her snap. Yes, 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 yes. You know, it's like you you talking to a bitch, and then she got guys like constantly, but like literally while you're talking to her. That's what my ex did because like she was texting him and she was like living with me. Exactly, bro. Yeah, fuck yeah. yeah fuck you know fuck my ex, up. right? Hey, fuck your ex. Exactly. Hey, fuck that ex. <laughs> hey, fuck that ex. <laughs> the next question is going to oh. be, if you were to be a girl for the day, what is the first thing you would do? If I was a girl on a yeah. date, bro, I would take that guy to ask me to, I would take that guy to Ruth, to, to Ruth Chris, bro. I would be like, hey, take me to Ruth Chris, and I'll give you some bomb ass head. That's what Ooh. I would do if I was a girl. I hey, gotta get them that guac hey, you know what's good? Fuck yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, sir so the last and final question, bro, uh, is yeah. if you're to fuck a porn star for a day and get her pregnant, if I who would? A, yeah, uh -huh. who would you fucking get pregnant, bro? Ooh, I mean, honestly, it would probably have to be Brandy Love because she's like, bro, you know about Brandy Love? Yes, bro? sir. She's a <laughs> Today we're here with Jay and Tay. And Tay. Tay. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, uh, JT. Okay, I see. I see. I like that. The first question I'm gonna ask y'all is, what is the biggest red flag in a guy? Oh, he lives with his baby mama, but they roommates. What do you mean by that? Ooh. Guys will say that, oh, I live with my baby mama, but we just roommates. We don't fuck or nothing. Bitch, go to hell. Damn! Now, you know they lying. They fucking. Exactly. What about they you? fucking for real. Well, they don't got a whip. And they don't got a job? Oh, whip. No, definitely when they don't oh, have a job. Yeah, that too. Whip and sure. a job. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. They don't have no hustle. Oh, no hustle, no yeah. motivation. The next question is going to be, if you could tell your ex one thing and one thing that you really wanted to tell him. Honestly. Get up on your shit, bro, boy. Ooh. Get up on your shit, bro, but boy. me, I miss you, Loki. Oh, shit, lot. <laughs> <laughs> and the last and final question is, if you're to be a guy for a day, what's the first thing you do? Get my dick sucked. Oh, yes, man. That's all I'm talking about. Y'all good. Reporting live from 6th Street, Austin, Texas, a guy got his ass knocked the fuck out, but it's okay. We're gonna go get a, um, what's it called, a public interview real quick and see if he's okay. Alright, so today we're here with... Tim. Roberto. Dante. Nav. So the first question I'm gonna ask y'all is, what is the biggest red flags in a female? Hey, you look I got one. You. My, my ex. <laughs> got him. Ooh. Why you say that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, she dropped me, I mean... My ex did the same, but she fucked around with her. Same. What you got, bro? No communication, bro. No communications, no I feel that. Too many dudes around her, bro. So, like, if she had a guy best friend, how would you I feel? I would friend. not fuck with that. You wouldn't? Would you even yeah, check to see if he was gay? No, not even? I would, but that's that's just me. Okay. I'd probably say my ex, too. She filed a lawsuit on me. 
Damn. 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 So if you were to be a female for a day, guys, what's the first thing you would do? Let my homies hit. Oh, shit. <laughs> what? Oh, Hell yeah. <laughs> but fuck yeah. I would let my homies hit too. I'm gonna have to agree I don't think I can put that on camera, bro. I'm going to have to agree with him. You, know? yep. you have to. You got to. Got to. What about you? I probably fucked myself. What did he say? <laughs> because I want to I want to see how that shit feels, you know what I'm saying? Hey, I ain't get a cap, bro. No, hey, I, Hey, I mean, I, the last and final question is, if you could tell your ex one thing and one thing only, what would you tell her, bro? She broke. I'm up. You feel oh! Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Fuck that ex, bro. Yeah, I was going to say what he was going to hey, say, bro. We up. We up, right? Yeah, we up, bro. Yes, sir. I don't got one, bro. Aw, I felt you, bro. I'm a virgin too, I understand. I felt that. What about you? Yeah, I look you want her back, but like, it's all, it's all good. I said the same thing, but she blocked me. I feel you, bro. I felt you. Alright, so today we're here with? Young hair fight. Oh, I bet, bet, bet. So the first question I'm going to ask you is, if you could tell your ex one thing, bro, and you want to be brutally honest, bro, tell me what you want to say. Shit, fuck that hoe, you fuck know, that fuck hoe, that hoe, shit, I could do better anyway. Yes, know? sir, we like that. that. We turned hey. up in the city for real, yes, though. Yo. So the next question is going to be, if you was a female for a day, bro, what's the first thing you would do? That's a hard one. <laughs> hey, that's a hard one. Would you snitch on your homies or would you cheat on your girl? I'm cheating on my bitch all day. All day. Hey, Every day. Are right, right. Hey, yo, hey, that's my brother. You know we gonna slide for him. Hey, we gotta slide, right? Yo, we gotta hey. slide, yes, sir. Yeah, and so the last man. and final question is: I know it's gonna be a little fruity, bro, but you gotta trust me on this. Would you suck a man's dick to save your mama's life? Bro, no, hell no. You wouldn't do it? Hell no. Bro, hey, she gonna yeah, die. Shit. Fuck it. Bro, hey, <laughs> if it was me, bro, I love my mom off in a. Do that little hey. grapefruit technique. Hey. Oh, uh. And I, oh, hell no. <laughs> hell no. I love my mama in office shit. This her time, this her time. You know what I'm saying? Hey, okay. Gobble me, swallow me, right? Hell no. no. <laughs> <laughs> So today we're here with Michael Cam. So the first question is what is one of the biggest regrets you have with your ex? Um, cheating on her. Ooh. Not hitting. Ooh, I felt that one. Add on to mine. Cheating on her with a white girl. Bro, are you serious right now, bro? So the next question is, what is the one of the biggest red flags in a female? Well, she don't smell good, bro. I hate bad odor, but this is so nasty. Ooh, so say like her coochie stinks. How you gonna feel about that? Pussing her ass off. Right. Straight off the bed. Oh God, bro. <laughs> Me? My? Wait, what's the question again? <laughs> <laughs> when they too friendly. Mm, it's like friendly. other guys. Ooh, okay, so say like your female has like a really good guy friend, how are you gonna feel about that? Is he gay? Depends. I mean, if, if he's gay, then I'm gonna make sure he's gay. Hey, yo, what the fuck? What's, what the fuck you mean by that, <laughs> But if he's not gay, I gotta be cool with him. Mm, Whatever. Feel, for sure, for sure, I respect he gotta, have, he gotta have a girlfriend. So the last and final question is, if you were to fuck a porn star for a day and get her pregnant, who would you fuck? Man, wait, I don't know who, I don't know what her name is, but I follow her on Instagram. You it want me to start naming? It starts with, yeah, start naming. Maya Khalifa. No. Abella Danger. No. Uh, Why Lana do you know Rose? so many is the crazy part? D don't, don't worry about that. I, I have a lot of free time on my hands. Okay. So the last and final, final, final question is, what is one thing you can tell your ex? Stop being so fucking friendly. Here you at. Hate that shit. I'm God. Ho hope you having fun. All right. So today we're here with Zay. All right. So the first question is, what is one of the biggest regrets you have with with, with your ex? Date me. The fuck. Damn. Why? Date me. She's a bitch. So mm. she was. A, she was a bitch all the way around. My like, it was like try to do good. It didn't fucking matter. Mm, mm, didn't it, fucking matter. That was like my ex when she like when I tried to do good, she just exactly. down me. You we don't me? like those girls, exactly. right? The next question is gonna be if you could tell your ex one thing and all you wanted to tell her is like the most utmost anything you wanted to say to her, what would you tell her? Fuck you and die in a hole. <laughs> oh god, I'm, I'm sorry. Die, you can die in a fucking hole for all I care. Matter of fact, let an 18 wheeler come in. Here. <laughs> and so the last and final question, bro, is what is one of the biggest red flags in a female? You can give me three if you feel comfortable with that. All right, if she got one or two, she got if she got one or more instas, automatic, automatic. I mean, if she got a, if it's a business page, okay, cool. But if you remember, if this is like a spam and stuff, exactly. Like that. I mean, this generation nowadays, a lot of shorties just looking for bread. Bang, they ain't even looking for love. It's just whatever you can really do for them. It's not, it's not even about the dick size no more, right? It's not. It's really not. It's all about what you can really do for him. If you mm. if you ain't putting out no type of bread, no nothing, you ain't got a nice car, if you ain't got no nice clothes, nigga, it don't matter. It, it don't it, matter, it, right? It don't matter what you got going on, bro. Guys, you want to go interview Mark? Sure, sure. Can we, can we do an interview? Can we sure, do an interview? sure. In the middle.
Oh, yeah. So I got some questions for you. Let's set that down. You gotta make a little quick question. Okay. I'm a businessman. All right. First question. Who styles you? Who styles me? Who styles you? My mom. Oh, that sounds pathetic. Next question. Ryan Reynolds or Ryan Joe Berg? What did he say? Hey. Oh. I don't even need to answer that. Why, why would I go with Joe Berg? Yeah, he's fruity. He's fruity. Uh, what is your biggest accomplishment? Biggest accomplishment? Having my subscribers and just making it this far in life. And oh, wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Dropping my merch. That's that's the biggest accomplishment, actually. Y'all should go shop at the Mark Anthony on Instagram. Oh, well, underscore the Mark Anthony underscore, and get yourself a T-shirt because look at this. This is too fire not to buy. It's twenty five bucks. Why not? You know what I mean? Mmm. What is? No, who is someone that really made a difference in your life? Damn, that's actually a good one. Fuck. First off, it's gotta be my mom and dad. That's the first one. That they made a big impact in my life. Secondly. It's definitely gotta be my vlog squad because they really made a big influence. And fourth, it's gotta be my sister, man. I ain't gonna lie. My sister really, really did make a big impact on oh. my life, man. If it wasn't for her and her husband, I wouldn't be here in this point. Next like question, it. next question. What's y'all gonna sound like? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay, okay, next one, next one. Peaches or cherries? Isn't cherries like titties? You are so dumb. Damn, I don't want to. I don't want to grow with no cherries because if a girl have no cherries, then that's a dude. But if it's a girl, if it's a girl guy with no ass, then I'm gonna be standing in straight cardboard. I got, I got it better. Got it better. Peaches, cherries, or sausage? Sausage. <laughs> Gay. So today we're here with. <laughs> I tried to think of a name on a spot. On a spot, God damn it. Nah, fuck. I'm gonna say LJ. This question is: Is too much makeup like a catfish, basically? Yes. Don't care. Yes. <laughs> Damn. I don't care. You using you using all of this colors and showing your skin, bruh, just to hide who you are from me, bruh. I refuse, bruh, because you showing this on social media. No, yeah, no, she bad. Yeah, right? yeah. You know, I go over there, get yeah. gets, get a wet napkin, I just God damn it. The next question is, if you're a fucking porn star for a day and get a pregnant, who would it be? That is infinite. And you know what? Because yeah. you know how I many niggas tap that shit. Who? Mia Khalifa? Mia? Lana, yeah, Mia Khalifa, Lana Rhodes, Tiana Trump. Two hours later. Riley, oh no, Piper Perry. No, no, no. Piper Perry. I don't know if y'all know her, bro. I don't know if y'all know her, bro, but Miss Natural. MZ Natural. MZ Natural. I'm going to go search her up tonight. Bro, yes. I'm going to go you search her up won't tonight. be disappointed, bro. I won't. Whenever this happens, I'm going to text you. I'm going to be like, hey. I busted to Don't tell me some weird shit. <laughs> Alright, so the next the last and final question is is what is the biggest red flags in a female? This is gonna start a war answering this bro, there's a lot of red flags. Mm -hmm. One, if they're not goal oriented, like nah. If, mm. if and that like that leads into like making your own money and all of this shit like that too. Cause like I'm not getting no girl that's gonna feed off me every day. I'm gonna kill my back and everything to make money. I had, had that girl. That? Yeah, I had a girl that did that. You had a gold digger, bro? Yeah, I didn't know that, though. I was an idiot. I just drop her. She dropped me. Damn. Nah, that, that's, that's tough, my G, bro. She done took the bread, then dropped you. She took the bread and dropped me. But she did get the Oh, okay, okay, okay. What'd she say about that? What'd she say about that? She said it was small. She said it was pretty good. It was pretty good. It was pretty, it was pretty, good, pretty it was, good. It was it was an average Asian. Did she, did she say <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so today we're here with Crystal. <laughs> Wait, not the mic. <laughs> and we're here with You know who I am, bitch. What the fuck you know my name? Who you are. Orlando. The first question I'm gonna ask y'all is what is one thing you regret with your ex? I don't have one. Oh, okay, okay. We don't blame anybody. Don't have one. Oh, okay. Oh. What is one thing that you wish you could change about Mondo? It could be his <laughs> size, preferably, but you know. <laughs> you want to say, don't you? <laughs> no. <laughs> um, his patience, the way he eats, Ooh. the way he just yeah, he is sometimes, his Ooh. attitude. Ooh. What's your uh, biggest ex about Crystal? <laughs> Nothing really, though, because I know her how I met her. Oh. <laughs> the last and final question is Amen. What is your biggest pet peeve? When people suck on their teeth That like, shit pisses, yes When they're eating ooh. Or just on the daily I'm just like, shut the fuck up <laughs> Like it makes me want to throw around and chunk something at them So like say, you know Honda, you know, Say he was like, the gobble me, swallow me And stuff like that you, And he like smacks You gonna get uh, egg bite? Yes Really? So if it, uh, I don't know, I'm not gonna go that far into sex. What the fuck you sucking your teeth for? <laughs> Amanda, what's your biggest pet peeve? 
Well, fucking people staring at me. Yeah. It's just there. It don't say shit. So no like, a random ass people just stare at you. That's attitude it. Like problem. attitude. Do this at least. He's just a like bitch. that. Yeah, something. The people just stare. I hate that one. So if I was just stare. sitting there across the room from you and you just looking at me, yeah, I would be mad. Uh oh, hello guys. That's it for today's video. Don't forget to leave a like, comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe. And also, be sure to leave some comments down below that y'all want me to ask some questions, and I'll ask them in the future videos. Anyways, guys, I think that's it. Do you got anything to say? Videographer? No. Anything to say behind the camera? No. Let's say what? Leave a like and comment. And, and don't forget to what? Comment. Oh, and oh, oh, and subscribe and uh, buy his wait, merch. Wait, wait. Buy his merch. Buy the merch. <laughs>